I think I've reached the end of this dungeon. I mean, there's nothing else here. I should be finding the treasure chest somewhere around. <laughs> you fool. Did you honestly expect me to leave my treasure chest unguarded? You shall pay for your insolence. You will never leave this place alive. Then face me, foul creature, and prepare to- Wait. What did you just say? Uh, what? You just said that I will never leave this place alive. What did you mean by that? Oh, that. I meant that the only way you'd leave this place would be if you were dead, and they carried your body out. I see. Well, that's... that's quite a predicament. Yes, that would be the case. But what if I was undead? Excuse me? What if I was undead like a vampire or some other creature? Or, what if I was petrified and removed so I could have the effect reversed later? Could I leave then? I guess. I mean, you're technically not alive in either scenario. And what if I chose not to leave? What if I decided, hey, I want to stay here. Uh, could I do that? Could I stay here and stay alive? Is that possible? That's a good question. I've never thought about that before. I guess it's okay. Uh, make yourself at home. I don't have much in the fridge. I haven't done any grocery shopping yet, but I think that there's a goat leg and some cans of G fuel in there. Wait, people actually drink that stuff? Uh, yes, I do like it. Well, that explains a lot. What was that? Nothing. Anyway, what is your policy on guests? Well, I've never really had a policy. I mean, I set up pit traps and spike walls, but I never actively said, no guests allowed. Well, if you're that uncertain, I won't mess with your rules. Oh, uh, you should know that I'm wanted in a few towns, so you might have someone knocking on your door asking if you've seen me. Why would they do that? These wound marks are very strange, Hero. You said they were killed by orcs. We had our chief resident physician examine the bodies, and these were her notes. And I quote, This arrow is not from any orc tribe that I know of, and this cut is too clean for any orc blade, and this victim was charred by a level 3 fire spell. Only adept magic users can do that. End quote. This is very suspicious, Hero. Did somebody say... Death by disease manifest? No, I was simply making an observation. Skibbity bobbity boobity boop! <coughs> oh no, we're dying. <laughs> Just a misunderstanding. It, it's nothing serious. Look here, just take this chest and we'll call it even, alright? I don't need any Imperial soldiers coming to my cave. Just go. But what about me not being able to leave this place alive? Those were just empty threats, okay? I only have 1100 HP, my attacks have really long windows that a four-year-old could memorize, and I can be staggered by attacking my knees. It's really easy to exploit me. Well, when you put it like that, I can't pass up on that offer. However, I could use the extra EXP.